Hello everyone and welcome to the King Abdullah Sports City here in Jeddah, the shining jewel as it's known. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And without doubt a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. How do you see the match going, Stuart? Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully we get a really good game here. This is the lineup for the home team. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4 5 1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Well, no surprise really, they're matching up here, but there are many different ways they can approach this game. And I just think they'll be cautious today, certainly early on. And the game begins. Now can they make something happen? Shot attempted. And how about that for a save? Delivering it, clattered away. The outcome is a goal kick here. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Niakate. Well, far from the ideal pass. He's lost it. A potential danger here. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. So, underway again here. 1-0 the score. And taken away.
Yusufu Niakate. Well, they keep passing away. Well, trying to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. This looks interesting. The keeper diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Now sending it in. Well cleared away. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. He's got the right eye pass. Now what can they do from here? Precise ball movement. In position. Blocking it. Pulls it back. Will he find the net? And there it is, the goal they wanted for security. They lead by two now. They can breathe that bit more easily. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. But the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. So 2-0 now. chance for him to get in behind maybe oh incredible save and he snuffed out any sign of danger and over it comes no nonsense clearance. Well, there it is. The hosts haven't had that much of the ball, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Good looking ball, there could be a chance now. Promising possession this. But they took care of the situation defensively. El Ahmadi. The first half here comes to an end. Well, he hasn't quite had the impact on attack that we were expecting, Stuart. Well, he has to find space in more dangerous areas. He's such a good player around the box, but today he's struggled to get on the ball. And that's one of the reasons they're losing here. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Fluency of movement. Yusufu Niakate. Albishi. They've given it away. And they could face difficulties here. Now the task is to remain focused. A wild effort it was, and probably the less said about it, the better.
Oh, that's an interesting pass. And he's apparently veered into an offside position, Stuart. Well, that's tight, really tight. But he was just too anxious to make his run. He was in, though. Albishi. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Determined block. And effectively parried away by the keeper. Well, no let up. Plenty of pressure. Well, the pass not coming close to hitting the target. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. El Ahmadi. Karim El Ahmadi with it. And possibilities here. And an astute piece of defending. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Well, as you can see, the hosts have controlled the possession. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Can he put it in? And it goes! A three-goal cushion! This is astonishing stuff! Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. There to win it back. Oh, fancy footwork. Can they convert? It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. But when he shoots, I expected him to go across the goalkeeper. He should never beat the goalkeeper inside that near post. That's not good keeping. So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? Albishi. Every pass hitting its target. And a chance to whip it in here. Albishi. Seemed to switch off for a moment and now a throw in. Well, they've decided to make a change. Could play it in. Can he put it away? That's high-level goalkeeping. Well, that's a fantastic save. He's such a good keeper. Oh, 
Well, they fancy a short one. And it took a touch on the way through. So a corner here. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. And deciding to go short with this one. Went in strongly, decisively. Well, happy just to keep it near the corner flag. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. And now, passing it through, and a goal to settle the issue once and for all. Well, just look at this. He couldn't have placed it any better, could he? The keeper had absolutely no chance there. And that will be all for this game. Defeat for the visitors, that's the big story. Well, Derek, that just wasn't good enough today. A lack of a game plan, too many players below par, and not enough energy all around the pitch. A really worrying performance for me. No two ways about it. He really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.